For tonight's area code, we are in the 202 at Black Lives Matter Plaza, where people continue to use this space to fight for equality, including Reagan Rogers and Tiffany Dunstan, who are holding double dutching events every Thursday night at 7 p.m. as uh, what they're calling a joy protest. Tiffany and Reagan, thank you for being here with us. Thank you so thank much you for, having for having us. Thank you for having us. Thank you. How'd you come up with this idea? Well, um, originally, I, I wanted to just jump rope. And I put out a line on Facebook to see if anyone else in the area would want to join me. And I reached out to Tiffany through a church group chat. And I was right on board. <laughs> she was on board from the very beginning. And um, we had this wonderful idea, like, let's take it to Black Lives Matter as a joy protest in the midst of all the chaos of the pandemic and of the social unrest. Um, it just seemed like the perfect time, especially with Breonna Taylor's case. Um, being that we are black women, we wanted to make sure that um, it was almost a protest that we stood in solidarity with her through joy to say that you are not forgotten, your life has not been forgotten, and that we're still fighting for justice, even in a joyful way. And so why double dutch? Double dutch is fun. Um, that's something that we were talking about as a childhood memory that we all kind of have. Um, I've spoken to many of my friends and we all kind of have united in that way of, oh my God, we love Double, double Dutch. Let's come out and, and just jump. And like um, like Reagan said, it's all about joy. It's all about fun um, and, and bringing light to the situation of Breonna Taylor. There are a lot of my friends, a lot of people on social media have reached out and said, can I learn how to jump? I'm embarrassed to know that, to say that I haven't learned how to jump or I'm so excited to learn. So we're here to teach, we're here to learn, we're here to have fun, we're here to um, just unite in solidarity, all for justice. Absolutely, we want we want them to know that no matter how dark uh, the society may even be right now, that there's always joy to be found somewhere. All you have to do is just look and see what truly makes you happy and how you can get others to join in that happiness with you.